Hey y'all, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I am gonna be discussing how to lose your first 10 pounds. Let's get right into it. So overall, all the information on my channel is pretty consistent. I always advocate for a plant-based diet. That is what helped me lose 90 pounds. Ultimately, I just wanna put y'all onto the fact that the simple one or two small changes that you would make to your lifestyle in order to lose 10 pounds are the same small habits that you can stay committed to eliminating and see even more results with your weight loss journey. So take what you will from this video if you are starting off on your weight loss journey, but just understand you can go a lot further with your commitment and dedication and turn a 10 pound weight loss into a 30 pound weight loss, into a 50 pound weight loss, and completely transform your body. So the first piece of information I'm gonna share with you guys is you need to eliminate and replace. If you're overweight, your health is probably deteriorating in other aspects other than just your appearance. It is scientifically proven that extra fat storage on your body is a sign of other diseases manifesting. So what your main focus should be is just getting healthier, period. And through that process of getting healthier, you're gonna lose 10 pounds, 20 pounds, 30 pounds, however much weight you need to lose, and you're gonna get your health at a standard, at a level to where you can maintain that. I would recommend you stop eating processed. Stop eating out, stop eating anything quick, anything convenient that you're finding at these fast food restaurants. I don't care if it's a salad. Um, I don't think you should be eating out if you're trying to lose 10 pounds of fat. Eating out is really out of the conversation. For the most part, you wanna know what you're eating for the next day. You wanna have an idea of what you're eating way before you eat it. So real quick, I just wanted to be very clear that, you know, those spontaneous restaurant visits, oh, I'm just gonna go to Chipotle, I'm just, you know, gonna pick up lunch here or there, those really have to be cut down to a minimum, almost to none. I will be making a whole nother video on how to eat healthy while on the go, but for the most part, if you're trying to lose 10 pounds, I really recommend that you just kind of get I hate using the word strict, but you just kind of get firm with yourself and what you want out of this life, what you want out of your weight loss journey, and just try to see if you can commit to not eating anything out and just trying to make those healthy homemade meals as often as possible. That is how you're gonna keep things healthy and that's how you're gonna have more control over what is going into your body. So prepare ahead of time, know what you're gonna eat, you don't have anything prepared, that's not a legit excuse. You could have prepared the day before. Because you're no longer eating processed, you're gonna have to replace the processed foods with whole foods. And let me just give you a list of processed foods, just so that we get that out the way. Pies and pastries, microwave meals, or ready meals. So that those little um, frozen meals that y'all be thinking that y'all about to eat every single night, cut it. So pretty much anything that has like an extensive ingredient list, you don't wanna be eating canned chicken, canned tuna, um, it's better to get those things fresh and cook them yourself at home. Someone who's trying to stay on the leaner side should be eating more whole foods. So you're definitely gonna wanna slow down on the sugary drinks. So if you were like how I was, I was drinking coffee literally every single day. I say that to say drinking sugary beverages was a part of my every single day routine when I was overweight and it's something that I cut completely as I started to lose weight. So that is definitely something to think about. If you still want a caffeinated beverage, I would say look for an unsweetened matcha. Maybe you can throw some agave or some honey in there. Look for those unsweetened drinks or drinks that are naturally sweetened, um, such as like a green juice made with some apples. Before I get to this last point, make sure you guys go follow me over on Instagram, subscribe to this channel, also like this video if you are finding value in the information. I know y'all don't wanna hear this. I know nobody wants to hear this, but you need to exercise. I'm sorry, like you, you gotta figure out how you're gonna exercise. Everybody has excuses, what they can't do. Um, they need a trainer, they need this, they need that. Don't make excuses. You gotta work out. I don't care what your situation is, you can do something. I've seen chair workouts on YouTube. Okay, so if you can work out sitting in a chair, 
just commit to doing 30 minutes a day nothing changes if nothing changes if you've hit a plateau in your weight loss or whatever the case is you're just trying to start your journey back up with losing a solid 10 pounds incorporate some movement into your daily routine if you've been doing daily movement and it hasn't been working for you then maybe it's time for you to go a little bit harder you add some strength training if you haven't been doing anything at all then maybe it's time for you to start incorporating a two mile walk into your daily routine or maybe you start incorporating a daily swim whatever the case is nothing changes if nothing changes if you guys enjoyed this video make sure you follow me over on instagram make sure you like this video and also don't forget to subscribe to my channel bye guys see you in the next video